Ni mbali na hayo ni kwamba serikali ya kaunti ya Kiambu imeanzisha mchakato wa kuunda hazina ya shilingi milioni sita ya ustawi wa wadi. Hazina hiyo inanuia kufanikisha miradi ya maendeleo ambapo kila wadi itapata shilingi milioni kumi ili kuwezesha maendeleo mashina. Ni njoki murua anakina cha tarifa hiyo. Kaunti ya Kiambu ni mojawapo ya kaunti ambazo zina wadi nyingi nchini ili kuwezesha wadi zote kufaidika. Gavana wa kaunti hiyo Kimani wa Matangi amesema kuwa serikali yake inashirikiana na bunge la kaunti ili kubuni hazina ya wadi inayotarajiwa kufanikisha maendeleo ya wadi na kwa sasa hivi sheria hiyo tayari imewasilishwa katika bunge la kaunti ya Kiambu ili kujadiliwa akizungumza katika makao makuu ya kaunti hiyo alipoidhinisha mswada wa fedha wa mwaka huu wa kaunti ya Kiambu wa Matangi alisema kuwa hazina ya ustawi wa wadi inatarajiwa kusaidia kutekelezwa kwa mradi unaofaidi wa kazi the surest way that i have to ensure that the projects that are in the ward that will be uptaken fast as priority projects the surest way i have that their projects of in, of, of uh, impact is when there are projects that have been chosen by the person who has a stake in that particular project and the person who is with the people on the ground every time and that is the member of county assembly because when you are identifying those projects you are identifying the project that is at the heart of that community in that ward we want to go down in history as the third assembly that actually enacted laws and bills and make sure that we have the most developments that were done. Sheria ya fedha ya kaunti ya Kiambu itawezesha serikali ya kaunti kukusanya shilingi bilioni 7.9 na kuongeza mgao wa shilingi bilioni mbili kutoka kwa hazina ya kitaifa. Wamatangi amesema kuidhinishwa kwa mswada wa fedha kunaashiria ushirikiano wa serikali yake na bunge la kaunti hiyo kwa manufaa ya kaunti hiyo. Njoki Murua Runinga Citizen.